My name is Markle. I'd give anything to be on the other side again. Just a normal kid in a regular world. But then I remember that the world isn't regular anymore. And I remember that at any minute, a controller could be sneaking up on me, about to shove a slimy alien slug in my ear. Looking for Jake? Oh. Hey, Tom. Yeah, is he upstairs? I don't know. I just got here. Right. How'd you pick the name of I know, I did not do well. Hey, dude, we gotta stop meeting like this. We always hung out before. It'd be a bigger bust if we suddenly stopped. I agree. Yeah. By the way, your brother's here, man. That's why I have a door. Okay, let's try this thing. You're the computer whiz. Compared to you, maybe. All right, let's see what happens. It doesn't look like it'll fit. What, you have a better idea? Try Alt Escape X. Oh, oh man. Man. What's going on? What happened? Worked on Independence Day. Yeah, but they had Will Smith. <laughs> what? what are you guys doing? Just cracking up. Marco finally said something funny. What's next? I don't know. Any ideas? Let's sleep on it, okay? Oh, he takes it away. It's yours. Hey, Tom. Yeah, for a quick game, Marco's no challenge anymore. Nah, I get somewhere to be. Oh. Hey, do you think there's gonna be any college scouts there tonight? Gonna go for a triple-double or what? Nah. Team's history. I'm going somewhere else. Where? To a new club. The Sharing. Everybody's joining. Wait a second, you quit the basketball team? Jake, there is more to life than throwing a ball at a stupid hoop. What? Basketball's like your whole life. Not anymore. Anyway, we do cooler things at the sharing. And besides, the place is a magnet for girls. You guys should come. I'll see you two clowns later. You quit the team. You know all that stuff about how anybody can be a controller? Yeah. What do you say? What are you saying? I'm just saying that it's pretty weird that your all-star, all-state Mr. Basketball brother would suddenly quit playing hoops. Yeah, so? So? Maybe Tom's not entirely under his own control. It would never get to my brother. What? You think he's immune? He's too smart. You just don't want to see it. Have you looked in his ear lately? Hey, if you're looking for someone who's acting weird, why don't you start with your father? Did you have a job interview today? Yeah. Yeah, I can't. Oh. Great. Actually, I have something more important to do. Like what? 
I went down to the cemetery, put some fresh flowers out for your mom. Oh. Well, there'll be other job interviews. Yeah. Want me to call for a pizza? Sure, that'd be great. Sure. Um, where do you live, anyway? I'm down on Grove with my aunt. Last year, I used to live with his other uncle. <laughs> kind of get passed around. That must be rough. It's all right. I gotta get going. You know, I saw a hawk flying over my house this morning. What makes you think it was me? Something about the way it flew. Do you ever wish she could just fly away? Sometimes. Smile! Now you have a picture of your new boyfriend. Sarah! Oh, yeah, I really should. So you went to the mall? Yeah, and Stop I... right there, Marco. Yes, Mr. Chapman? You know, it always bothers me when the grades of one of our best students begin to drop. Mm -hmm. Well, if I find that student, I'll tell him you said so. Levity won't get you out of this. Maybe what you need are some friends that will be a better influence. Disgusting creatures. I didn't think you'd show. Oh, what are you kidding? I live for science lab makeups, bro. Hey, careful. <laughs> I dropped one earlier. I can't find it. Yeah, I saw it in the hallway. Chapman almost stepped on it. Listen, about what happened yesterday. I'll forget it if you will. I mean, we're dealing with some serious stuff here. It's a little more drastic than fighting is it. We were bound to go ballistic sooner or later, man. You know? I'm sorry. Me too, man. Blackmire, over here. Have you had any success in locating the Andalites? Not yet, but we're still looking. That's unacceptable. We know they're using human morphs, approximately the same age as my host body. Just find them. Yes, sir. Now, go stand and watch while I check the entrance to the pool. Yes, sir. Chapman went that way. Jake, I can't see very well. Weird, I can't see colors. Whoa, my tongue. It can smell things. It's between classes. No, I'm scared. Run, hide. Get a grip. Get a grip. Get a grip. Man, this skink is one nervous animal. Watch out. Is everything ready for tonight? Everything's arranged. Show me. Tom! No, Jake. I'm sorry, man. Very impressive. But it's been three days. Regeneration must begin tonight. At sundown. I need the Kondrona nutrients. How many new hosts will be there? 
50 new members from the sharing. But your host's brother is not among them. Why? Jake has a very strong will. He may be a problem for us. If he doesn't cooperate, we may have to correct the problem. Sir? What do we have here? Jake, help. Stay calm. Just stay calm. Nasty little creature. Jake, help! Disgusting thing. Stay calm. Just stay calm. Jake, help me. Marco, be cool. Don't worry, man. We're gonna help your brother. Jake, I'm really sorry about your brother. I'm gonna set him free no matter what it takes. When we do, I'm gonna take that yerk inside of his head and squash it like a bug. At least now we know that the yerks need some sort of booster treatment every three days. And we know a way into this pool. Whatever that is. Yeah, you'd think that Alfangro would have given us an instruction manual or something. You mean before or after he went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Visitor 3? Well, maybe that's what the disc is for. We need an instruction manual for that, too. This is where my mom works with all of the exotic animals. Exotic? Like rare chickens or something? Hey, listen, if we're gonna fight the Yerks, I think we're gonna need something a little more dangerous than a rat, a cat, and a dog. How dangerous is dangerous, dude? This looks tricky. I'll, uh, I'll give you a boost. Why do I have to go first? Because you're small. I can get you up there. Are you the leader? Why don't you go first? OK, you boost me. Man, that's barbed wire, Baboso. You guys almost finished. My bad, dude. Wow. Whoa. Look at that. They've all been fed, right, Cass? What is it? It's a white bangle tiger. Now watch his eyes. If they dilate, just back away very, very slowly. Slowly? Remember, all you have to do is touch it to acquire its DNA. Just make a fuffer sound. A what? A fuffer. Like this. <laughs> See, it calms him down. Yeah, sure. Easy, Jake. Slowly. <sighs> Hey, buddy. <laughs> Remember, when you acquire its DNA, it'll go into a trance. How about that moment before the trance when it rips his arm off? This one's for you, Tom. You're next. I've got it. You till the lion hearted. Yeah? Well, Marco the chicken hearted says let's go before we become lunch. Good idea. Hey, Jake, don't take this the wrong way, but, um, you think you should leave Alfangor's disc in your room? You're right, but I already thought of that. From now on, it goes where I go. Cool. We're gonna help your brother, bro. I promise. You think we'll pass this human controllers? We'll find out tonight.
We have many hosts to regenerate tonight. I will be in my chambers. Notify me when it is done. Yes, Mr. Three. You, stay in the regeneration line. Over there. Move over there. Regeneration line over here. Moving. We report directly to Visser 3. Get out of our way. Gotta do something. It's Cassie. What is she doing? I don't know. Something wrong? Come on, let's distract him. Do it quick. Having a hard time getting out of her ear. Turn your head. I'm almost free. You have Vista 3 to your right and two Horde Bajir behind you. Thanks, Tobias. What is going on out there? You okay? Yeah. I'd give anything to be just a regular kid again. But no. Now I get to change my shape more often than I change my underwear. But when I saw Jake's brother and all the others trapped, taken over, controlled, I realized I'm one of the lucky ones. That was wild. I'm glad we're all okay. Tom's not. 
There'll be another time, Jake. We'll get him back, okay? And Tobias, he did it again. If it wasn't for Tobias, I'd be roadkill. Thanks, Tobias. Tobias? That's not him. What? You mean I've been talking to a bird all the way back? No. You don't think. Tobias? Rachel, I'm sure he made it out. Tobias! 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 Hey, Tobias! 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 Don't miss the special message from Jake. Coming up. Seems okay now. <laughs> I'm sort of paranoid. I thought for sure that was my brother Tom. There's an army of slugs trying to take over the world and my brother's one of them. You know, when Marco told me that, I didn't want to believe him. But I knew something had happened. I mean, he changed. We, we stopped hanging out about a month ago. I was kind of missing him. He didn't seem to have time for me anymore. And when I found out that he was one of them, a, a controller. He's not going to stay one. I'm gonna use Elfangor's gift, the power to morph. That's gonna save him. You know, being responsible for fighting an entire Yurk army, I'd say that was kind of a lost cause if it weren't for the ability to change into animals. I'll try and describe to you what it's like See, the transformation is the weird part. The scary part is wondering if you're gonna be able to control the animal instincts. Imagine hair growing out of every single part of your body in a matter of seconds, and at the same time, your bones twisting and crunching and then restructuring. I mean, it doesn't really hurt because your body kinda goes numb. And... There's no pain or anything, it's... It's not like that. But when I became my dog, Homer, all I cared about was the great smells. You know, meat, bones. The smells kind of take you over. It was really hard to stay in control. I mean, I almost... I almost lost who I was, and that was really scary. I mean, I had to find Jake inside the dog and fight the instincts to save my life. It wasn't easy. I did it. <laughs> and when I morphed into the tiger, a strong, ferocious animal, it was amazing. You know, I wasn't afraid for a second. <laughs> no, I never had any doubt that if I fought, I would win. I was strong. No yerk was going to stand in my way. Feeling like the tiger has changed me, you know, made me confident, stronger. I'm not af I'm not as afraid anymore. I know my friends and I can save Tom. That's what we're going to do. No matter how long it takes.